everyone, it's Rose, and I'm back with another unbagging. Uh, this is apparently a very small diamond painting, or two it feels like. So I think I know what they are, but I didn't bother checking all the information before I started opening. So while you will know what this is, I will not. So if it is two diamond paintings, I'm only going to open one of them right now. And I'll open another one, the other one, in a separate video. So let's pull one out. Okay. All right. I know what that is. It is two diamond paintings, first off. So this is my 180th diamond painting that I've ever ordered. It is, uh, I, I named it um, uh, oh, very, very cleverly. I called it Many Circles. It's supposed to be 30 by 30, and it is a special shapes. So let's take a look at it. Now, where did I get this one? I got it in uh, from AliExpress, and what I'm doing right now is I'm trying out different stores on AliExpress. Uh, because I want to be able to try out different stores for my viewers uh, so that you guys, if you like what you see when you, when I open a, a diamond painting, you can, with confidence, order from the same store. Uh, so this one here I got from the Xeon Life Trading Store. And I'll just put the spelling of that name up here in the corner if you want to look for that. Uh, I also have a link to the painting, of course, down below in the description. Now this one here cost me $5.93 Canadian. I did not get a discount on it, which doesn't surprise me for that price. And uh, in US dollars, it was $3.47, okay? So I got it because, as you know, I, first off, I like special shapes. I like lots of bright colors and I like maximum diamondage. And so this one here seemed to meet all of those uh, requirements for me. Uh, before I show you the drills, I'm gonna show you the kit. It's a standard kit. It's a single placer pen, a regular green boat, which I love, um, little plate of wax. You don't need much for a special shapes. And then it looks like three baggies. So that's nice. Um, I'll just set that aside. Okay, and now let's measure the drill area because I will not be framing this, but I know that many of you like to frame or mount your diamond paintings. And so I'm just gonna do a measurement of the drill area. So it's 24 centimeters by 24 centimeters. What is that in inches in case you're looking for a frame? You're looking for a frame that's essentially a 10 by 10 frame. Uh, you'd have to put some sort of a mat or a border, you know, maybe some washi tape around some of this if you were to get a 10 inch frame. A nine inch frame would be too small. Uh, nine and a half would be perfect. Okay, so uh, let's take a look at the legend. There's two legends, one on each side. I've never actually checked, but I assume that the legends are the same. Uh, but I'm not going to check that now because it would just be silly if they weren't. Okay, so we have a whole bunch of symbols here. They'll be easy to distinguish. Yeah, there we go. 19 different kinds of special shapes. So that's nice. And then let's take a look at the drill field here. Look at all that diamondage. That's a lot of diamonds. So this is gonna take me a while to do. It'll be fun. Like, I don't know, it might take three, four hours. Um, it'll be fun. And I'll do it pretty much all in one shot, I think. Yeah. Oh, look at that. It's pretty, it's pretty. Colors are pretty. There you go. What's not to like? All right, so I'm going to now open up the cellophane bag. If you don't like the crinkling, oh well. Okay, 
I have people who like crinkling and I have people who don't like crinkling. You can't please everybody, so uh, I'm not even going to try. I'm going to please myself. Okay, uh, so here we have a lovely blue large faceted rhinestone. Uh, I'm going to put the flash on. There we go. Beautiful. Super sparkly. I'm going to stand up because I really can't see what you see. Okay. Am I dropping things? No, I'm not dropping things. Okay, so here we have another beautiful, beautiful purple. These are teardrops. And are they faceted? I think they are. So that's pretty. And then here we have yellow, teensy, teensy, tiny teardrops. Beautiful. That's going to be uh, challenging to place. <gasps> Look at these. They're so sparkly. Beautiful polychromatic rhinestones, just clear rhinestones with the um, polychromatic coating on them. And we have here some polychromatic green with the sheen of purple and green and blue and pink. Beautiful, lovely, love it. Love it, love it, love it. And then here we have polychromatic green seeds very nice, beautifully faceted with that lovely purple color. Here we have these beautiful, rich blue cabochons. Lovely. Ooh, look at that. There's not a lot of them, but they're going to add some real glam to this diamond painting, as if it needs more glam but you can never get enough, right? So yeah, that's beautiful. So those are just clear rhinestones that have a polychromatic coating on them, lovely. And then here we have, it looks like red cabochons that have a polychromatic coating on them. So you get sort of a purple and pink effect, very pretty. And then we have the ribbon packaging. Um, I'll do the count later to see whether we've got everything we have, but here we've got white with polychromatic AB coating on it. And here, oh, just this beautiful crystal, crystal, that's it. The beautiful crystal ye uh, yellow, gold, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And then we've got this lovely green, sort of like a chartreuse, very pretty. And then a purple, very, very nice. Orange, yeah. Some deep blue, that's beautiful. And look how sparkly they are. And then here we have just a paler blue. Yeah, that's really pretty. Beautiful pale blue, paler anyway. <gasps> look at the pink. That's just gorgeous. That's gonna pop. And here we have a little bit of a paler pink. Very, very pretty. It's like a rosebud pink. And then here we have an even paler pink. Very nice. And that's the one. Okay, so let's see if I got enough, if I got all the drills I need. There's 10 here. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 and 19. Yep, I've got everything I need. So I have a beautiful diamond painting to do here. Uh, look at the beautiful, beautiful colors. It's a happy, joyful picture, I think. And it was just crazy cheap. Like crazy cheap. $3.79 US? Come on, you've got hours of fun here. That's the cheapest entertainment you're gonna get. Um, Yes. So I want to say that I would definitely order from this store again. Um, good prices, good quality diamonds. Let's see about the adhesive. Um, yeah, good, good adhesive. Yeah, good adhesive, and I'm, I'm taking time to look at it because what I'm seeing, and I'll see if you can see it too, 
what I'm saying is that the adhesive only appears where the gems are going to go. So uh, you won't have to necessarily do something to prevent the gems or to prevent the, um, the background from getting lint on it because the only place that there's adhesive is actually where the drills are, which is awesome. So that is a special surprise, which I wouldn't have expected for just $3.40 or $3.47 US. So, um, so yeah, I'm, I'm really happy about that. I'm going to flatten this out a little tiny bit. There we go. And there we go. Okay, so that's it. That is my many circles, number 180 in my collection of diamond paintings. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And if you uh, haven't subscribed to my channel, why don't you do that now? You can ring the bell so that you never miss a video. If you haven't already visited my Patreon account, I'm going to stick the link to that down below here so that uh, you can visit there and decide whether you'd like to support my channel with a monthly or a one-time donation of some kind. And to all my viewers and subscribers, you know I love you, whether you subscribe, whether you're a patron or not, you know I love you. And you know I love to get your comments. So please leave me a comment down below. Thank you to all my patrons. I appreciate you. All right, everybody, I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you come back and visit with me again soon. So this is Rose saying goodbye for now. I'll be back with you soon.